Hi guys, this is a weird update. I know I look funky, but I'm really having a hard day and this is the second day and I just wanted to come record this while it's going on so that I can kind of remember this moment. Um, I'm really pissed off or well, sad. I know it's normal for Pearsons to like, you know, swell if you bump into them or, you know, have infections or something, but I've been getting Pearsons for at least 10 years, at least. Maybe like, maybe eight years. And I mean, I've pierced everything, my tongue, uh, I got like a dermal, I've had a tragus. Um, I've pierced a lot of things, eyebrows, and they've never reacted. The most I ever got was my nose. This is the third time I'm piercing my nose. Um, and back then I used to have like, I think a hoop, and I used to use my sponge on my face and it would yank at it so it would swell. But that's as much as it ever got. And once I realized what was going on, I started using face cloths. And that never, that stopped happening. I think it was only that one piercing that ever reacted. But I've pierced my ears several times and everything's been fine normally until this one. <laughs> um, so two days ago, first of all, this one started to kind of swell a little and hurt. Um, and I would chew and I was like, ooh, that feels funny. Like, I feel like it's swelling. And I had Brandon look at it and he said, you know, I think it is swollen on the inside. Um, but I cleaned it. I put some, you know, hot, uh, some hot water through um, and I sprayed it with my saline solution I'll show you all right I just recorded this whole thing and come to find out I had my finger on the microphone the entire time so I'm really pissed so hi um, happy Tuesday to you I don't know what day this is gonna go up because I'm gonna try to do updates until I heal I'm not gonna put it up until I heal because I need to heal <gasps> but I'm really irritated right now because my skin normally is pretty good at healing and bouncing back and I've been pierced in my ears for like eight years and I've always been fine. Like I've gotten pierced in Boston, um, in here in Charlotte before, uh, just I've been getting pierced since friggin freshman year of college um, and suddenly my skin wants to act all brand new and freak out. Uh, so yesterday at work I had my wig on and I felt uncomfortable and I wasn't sure what was going on. The night before, this little piercing here, the day, th um, it had kind of felt like it was swelling. So I quickly cleaned it and I freaked out and I cleaned and cleaned and put hot water and it was fine. But then, I don't know why, for some reason, at work, this ear started getting irritated. So I thought it was because the lace front of the wig was resting on my ear. So I kind of shifted it up and just hoped nobody saw how weird my wig was lying. I didn't even care how I looked. Um, but yeah, for some reason that did not help. I came home only to find my ear was completely swollen. Um, so I washed it, I put it in hot water, I ran hot water through it, I did the, um, I used the wound wash, this little guy, um, which is, I don't know why it feels empty, because I had something left this morning. Anyway, I did all I could to clean it up. And then I slept and I just prayed to Jesus, by the time I woke up I'd be good to go. I woke up and it was still swollen and I went to work I tilted my wig off because I can't just go from having long hair yesterday to like nothing today um, but I don't know for some reason I left work today and I took off my wig like in the car I could not wait to yank it off to see how my ear was doing still swollen so this is what my ear looks like and this is what the normal ear looks like so I don't know if you can see that I normally have like a whole, like a little bit of a curve here, like my skin folds over. Suddenly here it's all flat. So pretty much, I don't know what happened. Um, I had a an earring in the second hole that I never put anything in um, yesterday. So I thought maybe it was the earring that, cause I never use this hole, but it's still open. So maybe it was the earring cause it was an old stud that maybe triggered something and suddenly all of this freaked out. I took the earring out, I cleaned every single inch of this ear yesterday. I have to be careful because of all the other piercings on it. But for some reason, I think it's generating from up here. And it's like, it's not even like hurting, it just feels like it has a pulse. It's just like a little bit of pain, pain, pain. But it's not so bad, it's just constant. And um, so I called the tattoo guys uh, this afternoon. They told me the piercer isn't there Mondays and Tuesdays, but if it still persists tomorrow to come see him, and if he thinks it's like, oh, this is an infection for sure, he'll send me to a doctor. 
but usually like if your skin's not gonna accept the jewelry it'll reject it and usually it'll let you know this way but I saw enough videos telling you if you have an infection with your ear or any piercing do not take out the piercing um, the jewelry just don't take it out just it'll make it worse so I haven't taken them out and I haven't touched them, but I do move them back and forth when I clean them just in case that's the issue. But I don't know what's going on and I just want to document how monstrous my ear is and I think it was bigger yesterday. Um, and then like it comes and goes, like it'll get really big then it'll come back to this size and I don't even know. I hope something <laughs> good happens so that I can film an update saying I'm better. Cause if I'm not, I'm freaking out a lot. So here, enjoy my big fat ear. I don't care about my acne right now. Enjoy my fat ear. Thank you. Oh my God. <gasps> Tonight is Tuesday night, so we'll see. All right guys, this is the next day and I'm doing my update. And as you can see, I'm smiling more. Um, so pretty much this is the good ear. And now this is the swollen ear. And as you can see, it's not as red as it was before. It's gone down quite a bit and I have to thank uh, a certain soap. <laughs> um, so this Provan um, soap right here, I got it on Amazon and it came like I think two days later or like the next day. Um, I got it the night, the other ear on Sunday night when I thought this ear was swelling. Um, and lucky for me it came just in time last night. So I used it, um, I used it last night and I just wash the crap out of this thing but as gently as possible then i ran a lot of warm water through it and then i sprayed some more of the um the other like saline solution um and then today in the mail i just i got this this is what i used to use before and it was either this or actual sea salt mixed in warm water so this was fine for my um dermal which is even more of a crazy piercing because it's in your skin if you watch how they put it in it's kind of weird um, but yeah, this worked for that, so why not try it on something as simple as this? Um, so I'm looking forward to the weekend because that wig life, I'm because it heals better when the wig is off. So when I woke up this morning, it was a little less, and then I went to work with the wig on, and I was just like, oh my god, I'm so scared something crazy is happening under this hair. Um, but I got home, and I took off my wig, and the ear was still, you know, not as bad as yesterday, so it was... Better. it was like this morning where it was less so I think it takes a while for the blood flow to return to normal but um, I got home and I washed it again with this little guy and then I sprayed it with this guy so I'm hoping somehow that that helped um, so I will do one more update hopefully tomorrow I'm back to normal I was supposed to go to the tattoo shop to show the um, to show the guys what happened but now that i'm all better i don't think so i think i'll just wait it out i think they were right it's normal after the first week for it to kind of get weird um but i think it's doing better i don't know um once again pardon my hair but if i wore the wig and then showed you it would you wouldn't be able to tell so i'd rather look ugly and explain myself better than like look cute and you can't tell what's going on but yeah so that's my update